Okay, Alison, well played first of all. Um, you're back in the final. How does it feel? Yeah, great. I mean, it's been two years. I won in here and just uh, happy to be back after uh, quite a bad injury on the back. So, uh, yeah, really happy I can play first of all and that I'm healthy and just being in the final is, yeah, is extra special. And the match today against Harmony, it seemed like you were in control the, the whole match. Did you, did you feel like that? Nah, not really. I mean, second set, I had to dig deep. I was a break up, then she broke me back. Uh, I was a break up again, and it was a tight game at 4 3, so that was a really important one to get to 5 3. And I did that well, and then I thought, like, okay, let's do this. <laughs> and at the start of the second set, I think you had three or four break points in that, in that game, and you, you didn't break. What were you thinking then after that? Yeah, I mean, it was last 40, and then I thought she played just five good points. Uh, I didn't really do anything wrong, so I was like, okay, she played well, I couldn't do anything. Just let her try to, to keep that up, and uh, yeah, at the end, I felt I felt comfortable in some moments to to take over. And obviously, you mentioned your injury last year with the back. How have you been feeling this year on court? Are you feeling kind of on the right track? Yeah, 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 for sure. I mean, uh, it's been tough after this, and you know, the back is fine, and then some small injuries are happening in, in the body, but now I'm fine. I'm just trying not to play too much, you know, practice. We have to control like the balance to, to rest enough and, and practice also enough. So it's it's been tough to figure that out, but I think we found it and now it's just take a rest and be ready for tomorrow. And obviously when you have an injury like that last year, um, how, did, how do you kind of come back from that mentally? How is that dealing with those emotions? Yeah, it's been tough. I had to talk a lot with the coach, with my team, um, how to to handle that situation. Also, you cannot have the expectations immediately after a, almost one and a half year without uh, a good match. So that was for me tough because I used to be in the top 100 and I have to come back playing 35 Ks and stuff. And I was like, whoa, this is really back to basics. So you, you need to make a switch in your head and just talk about it and yeah, and you know, day by day. And you mentioned that, you know, you used to be in the top 100, you know, getting through, through to the fourth round of slams is kind of what's the goal this year? I mean, I know it's quite hard to set objectives, but do you have a goal for yourself? No, I started in February. I was 750. I'll be top 300 now. So in a couple of months, it's not been bad. Uh, it's just to stay healthy, take it day by day. Uh, of course, we have some goals, but I need to be realistic. You know, after one and a half years, we have to I, give, I have to give myself like one year to get my ranking back up. Um, hopefully it can get so the quicker the better, but you know it's. I'm just happy now, and let's see that I can keep my body healthy, and the rest will follow. And obviously, you won the title here two years ago. You know, you've made some good runs at, at Wimbledon. Will you be able to look back at those results going into this summer and help you on the grass? Yeah, I just love to play on grass. It's a pity it's only five weeks a year, <laughs> <laughs> uh, and you cannot play it all. You know, I, I want to play as much as possible, but my body also is telling me like, okay, calm down. So yeah, it would be nice to have more weeks on grass and it really gives me confidence, you know, winning here two years ago, being in the final now, having played uh, well, uh, well at Wimbledon, just feeling really comfortable on the grass and yeah, just happy. Why is it, do you think your, your game suits the grass so much? What is it about it? Yeah, I don't like uh, the top spin and it's the flatter, the better, like the slices, the volleys, the uh, serve and volley, the drop shots. It's more like the variety of the game and that's what I love. and. My game is is suited for that. You're playing Tatiana tomorrow. You know you've played her, you've beaten her three times. I think all on hard court though. What what can you expect going into the match tomorrow? Yeah, I mean she's a good player eh? for sure on grass court. She loves it. She played well in Wimbledon, uh, I think two years ago. So it's gonna be tough for sure. Um, just trying to recover and play the best I can. You know the serve is gonna be important, and then just stay aggressive. It's the most important thing. And finally, is there anything you've been getting up to while you're in London? Do you have any traditions or anything you like to see? Uh, no, I mean, uh, I have been here alone for all week and my wife just arrived yesterday. So it's good to have some company now. And uh, no, for sure, now it's just about resting up and, uh, and be ready for tomorrow. It's good support for the final, yeah. <laughs> good luck, Alison. Thank you. Thank you.